Hello guys, hello everyone. Welcome to today's video. And to be honest with you, I am very, very happy that um, you are here with me this morning to in this new edition of um, uh, Italo Pivot Indicator. And if you watch my video previously, you will be able to see that I talked about uh, the Italo uh, Pivot Indicator. And this indicator, it's one of its kind when it comes to um, identifying pivot point, accurate pivot point. Um, this video is about the Italo pivot once again. I'm talking about the updated version. Um, if you watch the previous vi uh, version of the video, you will be able to see um, how I actually um, be able to get the the Italo pivot to work for you. And then I was be able to add a lot of things on the pivot indicator. I was be able to add multiple levels by going to settings. But in this video, we're going to be talking about how you can actually add. Um, the pivot indicator without going to settings you're going to see what has changed what is new and then how you can uh, use it to um blast profit into your account if this is your first time you are seeing me probably my name is joseph benson make sure you subscribe to my channel and click on that notification icon in case i have a brand new video just like the one you're watching here of course you will be notified Again, make sure you like my video because if you do that, you are telling YouTube that the video is very, very important and YouTube will go ahead and showcase the video to as many people as possible. So I don't want to waste any of your time. We're going to head over to my desktop over there and then we're going to look at the whole thing together, how you can use the Italo pivot to blast in profit into your accounts. Let's go there. Yeah, guys, uh, in this video, I want to share with you exactly what have changed with uh, the Italo pivot. Um, if you watch my previous video regarding the, the Italo pivot, you will understand how um, you can possibly take advantage of this indicator in order to make informed decision and to identify a vital key levels in the market and then to make an informed decision either to trade them by or sell. Uh, I really talked about that in the previous video regarding um, the Italo pivot. And um, the Italo pivot actually it's um, an indicator that is designed by Italo Santana. And Italo Santana happened to be uh, one of the veteran trader. Uh, trader in um, that's been trading the financial market with years of experience so uh any indicator um or system from the italy santana it's uh, it's a system that we actually need to pay a very close attention to look at it and then make sure we uh, have uh, our copy um the thing is um the, the the bonuses remain the same and then i'll keep the link uh, to get the italy uh, uh, pivot in the video description below so um once you get uh this uh, italo pivot indicator you will be having the ea 100 for free um which is part of the deal um of course if this is the first time you are seeing me or probably hearing my voice my name is joseph benson make sure you subscribe to my channel and click on the notification icon in case i have a brand new video just like this one you're watching of course you will be notified guys i will be talking about the italo pivot in this video what has really changed which is the version of the updated version of it and what you need to expect uh, in the new version i will quickly head over to my navigator and then i'm here you can see this is the former italo pivot and then this is my italo pivot uh, version 2 which is the two uh, the second version of it which is the updated version by italo santana and then i will click go ahead and click on okay um what has changed so far so good it's um this box here um i'm thinking about the the, the dashboard here it's actually what has changed and then um it's it, it, it just make uh, adding the um the pivot indicator uh very very easy to the charts and then um very very fast With, within a click of a button you are all good to go and guys i don't know what to say but i will be sharing the whole thing with you very very fast in this video so i want you to pay a cl close attention so you don't miss any of uh, the vital information right in this video now um this is how we are this is what you should be seeing if you are seeing here you will see that um the daily um the daily pivot has been checked and that is what you're seeing here this is actually the daily pivot from the italo santana and then you can see here already we are on the daily pivot and daily pivot for the day has not been hit yet so um remember what i just told you in the previous video that we need uh to um once we get to uh uh, the resistance we're gonna sell mostly and then if we got to the support we're gonna sell which is the, uh, the daily support level one or two we're gonna buy at that particular time so um the italo pivot is here to stay and to make you a whole bunch of money and um, to make you very very consistent in the market and right now i will be adding the weekly pivot to the charts and then i can add all i can add all the pivot i can add the daily weekly monthly quarterly half yearly yearly by yearly tri yearly um 
exponentially and then essentially which is i'm talking about more years and years and years and years added and but but i don't want you to add all of them because you're going to jump past the chart and then the chart will look very very um dirty and then you won't be happy while you're looking at the chart so i will be deactivating the daily and then i will believe i will believe in the, the, the weekly um pivot so far so good you can see the weekly pivot has been touched here uh um to add the week um today is um i think today is um friday or so yeah and then here what happened you can see the price went down a little bit and then break above the pivot the first uh resistance level and then settle down in the resistance level two and then come down and touches uh, the resistance level uh, one and then find it way again and break above the resistance level two uh resistance two and then heading over to resistance three and then uh, the price is right there. So this is now the weekly pivot from uh, the updated version of the Italo pivot indicator So you can see exactly what happened here on the weekly pivot and guess what guys You can actually apply this on all the assets. I'm talking about euro USD USD JPY uh, G GBP USD um, um, I'm talking about AUD USD USD card USD CHF NZD USD GBP JPY all the asset both major and minor currency pairs you can ask the Italo pivot and then expect to make a whole bunch of money in the market. So that is the point of this video. Again, let me also let you know that I can add the monthly and then I will deactivate the, the, the weekly and then activate the monthly. And if you go, okay, let me just zoom back a little bit so you can see that I am indeed on the monthly pivot. And this is just what I want you to see. And then I'm looking at the chart with an eagle eye. This is a center pivot. This gray line here is our center pivot. Uh, for the month and so far so good we are on resistance level for the month of um of june we are on the monthly pivot we are on the resistance level right at that spot i'm looking at this on the one more time frame okay so um the more deeper i go at times it's very very important you also increase the, uh, the time frame to four hour time frame so you can possibly see uh what i am seeing so if i want to like increase the time frame i can go ahead and select the four hour time frame and then i can zoom it in probably uh to see what is happening but one more time frame is also fine here and then um this is where we are sorry we're on the daily uh to take it to monthly and then this is where we are right now so uh we are on the, the we are on the monthly resistance level uh for the for the first time which is july we are on the resistance level so we expect the price to fall uh uh down more that is our expectation so far so good which well, for, with the help of the the Italo pivot um all this is totally fine i can go ahead and activate quarterly and deactivate monthly and then i will be looking at the quarterly pivot and then i'll do for half yearly which is four months i think so uh half yearly which is six months or so this quarterly is four months half yearly is six months and then um so far so good i'm half yearly and in six month time let me go to the higher time frame like the d1 and then let me look at the daily time frame um i don't know but i know okay so sorry we, have, we haven't activated yet and on the daily time frame you can see uh we are on the half yearly which is a six month has been activated um you can see we touched our resistance twice multiple times up to three times on the daily time frame the resistance uh the half yearly resistance has been touched uh on the eternal pivot indicator and then uh but we haven't touched any support level yet and then with the look of things i'm seeing that it's still going to touch that level again um for the half yearly so that is the point i'm trying to make let's go ahead and deactivate um the daily and the half yearly and let's activate the yearly pivot and then you can see on the yearly pivot you can see that we haven't touched anywhere yet even on the daily time frame and that is the point i'm trying to make and stress in this video this is what actually changed with the eternal pivot uh, the updated version and in the previous version you have to just drag it and drop into the chart manually if you if you if you need the daily um uh, uh pivot you have to go and edit the indicator and then activate the daily um pivot from uh the indicator settings and then it will be applied automatically or if you need the weekly monthly quarterly or half yearly you also need to edit the indicator and then activate them from the indicator settings and then it will be applied on your chart but in this case you don't need to go to the indicator settings um you will be seeing everything from your dashboard you can activate them just the way you want it and then let me go to buy yearly and then deactivate the yearly and then you can see that you can literally dig, dig this on all the asset and then you can see that try yearly and then all the years you want to add um it's right here you can see that 
all those settings you can add them automatically and then you are all good and set to go so the point is remain the same um anyone can possibly use this indicator uh called italo pivot in order to make an informed decision to uh make a whole bunch of money in the market almost every single day so i don't know what you feel about this actually but let me know in the comment section what you think about this latest uh, uh update released by italo santana uh, about his italo pivot the updated version uh the dashboard is just what i'm looking at and then how uh, anyone can use opportunity on, on that if you show the mix and um, if you want to show the mix uh which is uh, the center pivot you'll be seeing it for each of the pivot indicator for each of the pivot you're going to see the mids and then if you want to see the levels you can also activate uh, all the levels any uh, any of the levels you don't want you can actually deactivate those levels and then it's totally fine for you and everything is good to go and those levels will be deactivated but for me i think i need all those pivot midpoint pivot or uh, true support level three um you can see that um all those things have been added here and then i need them just the way they are now with the dashboard you are good to go um you can set all those things um from within a few clicks and, and you're all set and good to go so that's the point i want to show you and that's the things i want to show you guys uh, in this video and the link to get across to this uh, pivot indicator will be very much available in the video description below. I want to thank you guys once again for your time. And if this is your first time, you are probably seeing me or hearing my voice. My name remains Joseph Benson. Make sure you subscribe to my channel and click on the notification icon in case I have a brand new video just like this one. Of course, you will be notified. Thank you guys once again for your time. Hopefully, I'll see you guys on my next brand new video. But until then, I want to say bye-bye for now.